There we go. Sorry, my uh, I'd unplugged my mic at some point and saying something weird. Hello, hello. Carrying on with Watch Dogs Legion. Whoever told me this game was short lied. They lied. <laughs> Not that I'm complaining. I just don't like being lied to. Um, then I guess I am complaining. I guess. <laughs> so. Uh, We, were, we thought it was Sirs that was zero day. Then we were told, oh no, it's Richard Malik. I'm getting nothing here but an ain't blathering and nonsense. What are you doing? Gathering intelligence. Trying to, anyway. Works for me. Let's go. Yeah. So we thought it was Sirs, then we were told, no, it's Richard Malik. And then Malik's saying, oh no, it wasn't me. I'm not him. It's like. And now we've been told, is it. Oh, it is Albion now. It is Albion. Like. The, the the story pacing in this game is a bit weird. So many plot threads. Whenever I think of this, the Ride of the Valkyries, I just think of um, Burns, Mr. Burns, and he's like, I've been waiting 25 years for this, Smithers. Oh, sorry, sir, I must have taped over there. <laughs> oh, Smithers. Well, Smithers. Oh, Jesus, that could be nasty. Whoa. FBI. Claire used to broadcast from somewhere around here. That's all I've got, I'm afraid. Bloody analog technology. Hmm. If we're able to find her this easily, others will too. And they won't share our good intentions. Should hurry. But we've got time for a little bit of art. Time to brighten up the place. I like the skull. <laughs> Decoration is not my forte, but I'd say it looks quite nice. I'd say it looks all right. Way, hoppa, hoppa. Oh shit! No, oh no, it's further down. Ooh. Oh dear. This does not look Fox. good. They got to her. Oh, poor lass. She was one of the brave ones. Not many left these days. Fuck. I'd love to listen to you moan all day, but perhaps investigating her murder would be a better use of our time. Right. We'll get revenge soon enough. Put a bullet in those bastards. I'll have a look around. 
bastards nicked Claire's gear but missed this tablet. Bagley, do your thing. Slightly more than the usual security. Can't just barge past it. It'll take at least a polite cough and then excuse me. Give me a moment. A lot of footprints through here. Several individuals. Boots rather than shoes. One with a tread unique to a certain paramilitary supplier. I think it's from their autumn collection. I'll bet my left nut they supply Albion. But there's the clan Kelly Mark. Bagley, what's with all the graffiti, you reckon? Seems a bit excessive. Claire did release several podcasts critical of Clan Kelly, which you'd think they'd be used to by now. They're a criminal gang. They shouldn't expect flowers and thank you notes. I know the Kellys aren't the brightest, but leaving a signature? That's ah, dodgy. Tablet unlocked. Claire seems to have logged conversations on it. Okay, you've agreed to speak on the record. You are an intelligence technician at Albion and work closely with Nigel Cass, correct, Mr...? Just you. I can't believe I'm doing this. If they were to find out. I know. Only have to step outside to see how Albion treats people. What do you have for us? Proof that... Proof that Nigel Cass was complicit in the bombings. What? But that's... Here, transfer it to this secure storage drive. How solid is this information? It's a recording of him talking to some... Security, drop your weapon! You can't do this! Gather all our equipment and get it to the carousel. Do! Take that wall, then get rid of this body. She can stay here. <laughs> Gang vengeance is an horrible crime, ain't it? Fuck me! Cass sent a squad of his goons for Claire and that other bloke. That recording's got to be the real deal. Bastard knew about the bombings. Albion must have Claire's equipment then, along with the audio file evidence. Finally, this will be the end of Cass. The fucker will get what's coming to him. Heard that Albion twat talk about Carousel. Must be Carousel Plaza, center of Albion's Auto propaganda. Drive now wheel. Enabled. Sounds like as good a place as any to start looking. Hey, Panda. How's it going? Sorry I wasn't too chatty in your stream, I was lurking, I just uh, was getting myself sorted out. I literally just got back from work about an hour ago. How he's doing. Maybe he would be proud of me. Uh, Auto drive now disabled. Where are you going? Or is it just literally here? Uh, it's literally here. <gasps> he called me friend. <laughs> How's your Saturday going? Have you managed to? Uh, well, obviously, I know you're the streaming. Uh, you managed to Watch chill out. a little Albion bit after the uh, the busy week. Up that crime scene. There's also a lot of them around. Fine with me. Some rest and relaxation. They did declare. I wouldn't mind smashing some gobs. Yes. Well, let's focus on finding Claire's equipment, shall we? Useless. Ah! Execution. You found Claire's equipment, including her secure storage Whoa. drive, which shockingly appears not to have been tampered with, so the audio evidence is probably still intact. Suspect. Ah, 
Oh shit. Killing. No, Brandon. I loved you, Brandon. I loved you like a brother. Edith. Time for you to take Idiot. over. Yeah, imagine chill a bit when you sleep at four thirty. Oh wow. I've been there. Jesus. Her work was right. Yeah, work Frankly, was actually really good today for happen. Saturday. Unfortunately, that beat of your heart isn't the only thing that died. Anyway, you're up. Do not. Oh. I want the Get now. Ah! The drone, yeah, I can't believe we lost Brandon. He was a good man. <laughs> and turn away from the body. You when I started this stream, I wasn't expecting to lose Brandon so soon. Appears not to have been tampered with, so the audio evidence is probably still intact. This one went a lot smoothly than the last time. Yo, where'd you come from? Mother. Escaping in style.
I know you're listening. Let's talk. We told you the Prime Minister would turn you down. Brits love to see private military contractors on foreign streets, but not their own. He's a fool! This whole city, this whole country's collapsing. The military's held together with duct tape. Police are running scared. Someone has to save the people, Nigel. Someone strong. <laughs> they do. And I've already worked it out. The ideal targets are the Toan Conference, Parliament, and King's College Hospital. Motherfucker, it was him. I'll provide overseas tech teams for logistics, but you can source the bombs yourself. Non-negotiable. It cannot trace back to me. You're forgetting something. And I'll get you access to filament, as agreed. Now go away. Now Scarper, or they'll kill you for sure. Bloody pleasure, mate. a voice that makes you want to snap his smug bollocks in a pencil case, doesn't he? And Zero Day knew just which strings to pull to get what they wanted, didn't they? Filament. And Cass was willing to trade it for the keys to the city. Fuck. Don't know, fam. I think I always thought there was a chance for him to... Fuck! To be the man you thought he was. Sorry, Hamish. If that man ever existed, he's gone now. We have to get this information out there. To the people. You're right. When you lot get the chance, come to Piccadilly Circus. Been working with bags on something. And this proof is just the token we need it. Jesus. Ah, so it was Nigel Cass then. Well, he's the guy orchestrated it. We don't know we still don't know who Zero Day are. Or who that guy is. Turning. That was bad. This, this exact spot here is where I stood during the uh, Donald Trump protest march. I was actually a part of the march at first and then I stopped here to take pictures of the rest of the march coming past. And uh, I met a Donald Trump impersonator right on this spot who was just like wearing the top half of the suit and Donald Trump thing and the bottom half was hot, pan hot pink spandex and uh, Converse. And he was just walking around going, it was a good day. Okay. London, you've been lied to. Nigel Cass and his Albion peacekeepers intend to permanently control his city. The ideal targets are the Toan Conference, Parliament and King's College Hospital. I'll provide overseas tech teams for logistics, but you can source the bombs yourself. Non-negotiable, it cannot trace back to me. Nigel Cass collaborated with a terrorist to bomb this city. Then, he set up an orbital drone program called Themis that will target you based on your stolen data. I will not allow anyone, not even myself, to jeopardize Themis. I've given you the truth. Do as you will. Actually, fuck that. Resist. Not bad, not bad if I do say so, innit? Hamish! Ha <laughs> ha! Is that really you? In the flesh? Yeah, well, can't lock myself away from the world forever. Got a lot to make up for, don't I? Besides, you sorry lot need all the help you can get. Check it. Fucking wankers! Yeah. Albion won't just disappear. Hmm. 
Okay. Okay then. Sent that to every news outlet I could think of. They're gonna have it on the loop for a while. And when the people tweak to what it means, Cass is done. They'll be removed, prosecuted for high treason. They'll have no choice. We've done it. Congratulations, team. That's good. Really good. But can I take a nap now? Oh, it's been so long since I've even seen a shower. There is still the matter of Zero Day. You know, the rogue hacker group that conspired with Cass and Mary Kelly to blow up London. Jesus, Backley, all work and no play. Give the squad a second or two to bask in our victory. Safe to say it won't last long. I doubt this is the reaction you were expecting, but Nigel Cass is in the news again. Before we go, it's Tavlin. The government has convened to review its contract with Albion. Nigel Cass himself has responded to requests that he should surrender to the authorities in a heated call with the GBB. Shut up, listen to me. I will not be removed by the government or anyone else. I will die first. And many will die with me. They're calling for blood. They'll have it. This city belongs to me. I am its shepherd, and I will slaughter my flock before I relinquish it. Cass has barricaded himself in his White Tower headquarters and threatened to kill anyone that tries to stop him. He is heavily armed and considered extremely dangerous. Bloody mentalist. He's Shit. gone crazy. He's gone off the deep end. He's liable to take it to the streets in his state. We have no choice. We have to get to White Tower and stop him. Anyone else on my team? Nah. Drones. Mm, you're the only one. You're a, mm, a spy, maybe. One thing I could do with actually. Let's uh, run that up. Cloaking device might be handy. This place where he liked to tweak his toys. I'll bet he's barricaded himself down here. Won't be anyone but the true believers around the compound. Yeah, I better get to dealing with Cass, huh? Luckily, his reinforcements are limited to whoever's faffing about nearby. Yeah, glitch of the masks not working when they've got hats on it seems. How many times I've broken into this place? Like this is probably my third time at least. At, at least. We can guarantee it doesn't happen in his lifetime. Don't start talking when you're right next to them, please. That's not wise tactic. One bomb coming up! 
true enemy has finally shown its face. Well, its masked face. But what more can we expect of cowards? Dead sick. Come to destroy the one man able to resist their tyranny. Who do you think Project Themis would have targeted first? They're saving their own skins, nothing more. I found the answer to our problem and I will not stop until it's brought to fruition. Are you sure that's what you want to come up against? Do you want to test my resolve? Well then, come try. Such a slimy piece of shit. Behaving erratically. Initiate lockdown. We better find whoever hacked this vehicle. Shit! I know you're here somewhere. Here. I want to 
and take out everyone before I do anything else. Whoa, hello. <coughs> Cheeky buggers. Clear. Let's move on. Hey there. Bad. She fell off mid flight. Still one dude. Oh, there's another one over there. Is that just a civvy? I think that's a civvy that is running. Then let's... Bombs away! That takes care of security. You can now access the elevator to the bunker. Get justice for Brandon. So you've come to end it, have you, dead sick? But haven't you figured it out yet? What our mutual acquaintance Zero Day set in motion? My inevitable reign and your downfall. This is how it will always end. Natural order of people like me and people like you. I am the law. All right, Come Judge Dredd. Let me show you. What's going to show me, Ed 209? Metal Gear. Is he actually building a Metal Gear? This will be the ultimate deterrent. Oh shit, my balls. Your weapons are useless against that drone Cass is wearing. Complete the network bypass to power up the EMP stations. Cass has called in reinforcements. What a surprise. You've ruined my plans, Dead Sake, but only temporarily. Let's try it. I'll rig the city of you once and for all.
with that armor, you need to power up an EMP station by completing the network bypass. Am I talking to myself? No, I heard you. I'm just trying to work out where this damn thing is. is the future, the evolution of security enforcement. Shit! No! At least I'm not losing it this time. That fucking grenade. Alright, well at least I know what I'm doing this time. Useless against that drone Cass is wearing. Complete the network bypass to power up the EMP stations. Cass has called in reinforcements. What a surprise! You've ruined my plans, Dead Sake, but only temporarily. Weak points revealed. The EMP will fire away. Hmm. with a network bypass. More forces incoming. Check your tail. What you see is the future. The evolution of security enforcement. It is a Metal Gear, essentially. <laughs> you will not stand in my way.
get Hideo Kojima on the phone. His intellectual property is being violated. They won't even thank you! All your efforts, all your sacrifice, for nothing. This Metal Gear prototype is really shit. Let's get this over with! You can't beat me. I have an army behind me, ready to follow my em I'm clipping that. I have an army. What have you got? I have a bullet to your head. I'm impressed. I think your little resistance is ready to be London's protectors. Well, we're good enough to take you out. Oh, it's a thankless burden. And the people will hate you for it in the end. Even when it's for their own bloody good. <laughs> I think we'll let the people decide what's good for them. <sighs> There it is. Death Six Fatal Flaw. Your faith in people. You recruit all types, don't you, straight off the streets? Well, I used to have faith in people, too. I got a good man killed once.
There we go. Cass is down. Well, so that, that just strikes leaves... Nigel Cass off the list. Shame. I think he would have made a smashing zero day. We have plenty of work still to do. Cass may be gone, but Albion won't disappear that easily. Expect the powers that be to find fresh excuses to keep them on the streets. That said, I think we've earned ourselves a bit of a rest from zero day as well. When good men do nothing. London's protectors. Dead sick. COVID compliant mask. Good old drill string bag. Oi, you put down a mad dog dead sick. Needed to be done. This calls for a celebration, innit? And now that I'm not being hunted by a psychopath, I think I'd like to see that safe house of yours. Link me there. Oh, dead sick party. Dead sick party on the other side of town. We better drive fast then. Your somewhat reckless teammate has got themselves thrown in the old clink, I'm afraid. Difficult to resist oppression from behind bars. It will be a while before they're available. Pro tip, however, why not recruit a barrister to the team? I mean, no one exactly likes a barrister, but they do have their function. They should be able to shorten the jail time of imprisoned operatives. Auto drive now enabled. Auto drive now enabled. It's a very London tune, that is. You're breathtaking! <laughs> You're breathtaking! Oh, God, here we go. Here comes the football fans. Although, um, that tune is in this game. Which I think is pretty boss. You're a Welcome to the safe house. Think you'll join DedSec now? Nah, mate. 
Gotta maintain my free agent status. Not enough booby traps in this place. Still, I'm glad we linked up. Don't know who else would have had the bollocks to take on Cass. Losing their psycho cult leader is gonna hurt Albion, no doubt. But trust me, fam, they won't pack it in so easily. We need some and we need some enemies some for the post game. <laughs> yo, yo, yo. Yeah, look at our spy move. I, mate, I've been trying to find it on the radio again. It's just never turned up. I, I think I've heard it more on like radios in the background of places. So I don't know if it's like a semi-hidden tune. Oh, I also don't even know if it was originally part of the soundtrack or if they've just put it in recently. Because someone I work with said they hadn't heard it themselves. So, oh dear, our paramedics fucking wasted. Oh, Sarah. I've managed to acquire quite a nice little group here. Where's Edith? This is the granny. This is this is beekeeper granny. Hello, dear. She can summon a bee swarm. This is getting a bit Metal Gear. This is like uh, the pain. No, not the pain. The fear. No, it's fear. Well, who's the one in Metal Gear Three? Metal Gear Solid Three, who has the um, Inspector Lau coming to fraternize bloody, uh, the vigilantes. Bees around him. Out. Oh no! Welcome. I'm covered in fucking bees. I'm only human, and we've got a lot to celebrate. Cass finally got what was coming to him, and with Mary gone, the Kellys are on the back foot for once. Dead sec is making it hard to be a bad guy in London. Until the Met gets its bollocks back, I'm still on Team DadSec. Dancing by yourself in the, uh... In the train carriage. Granny got moves. I just love my bees and... throwing shapes in the Church of Sound. Taking a break from your dark web contracts, I see. A well-deserved one. Since we teamed up, the corporate class are thinking twice about fucking with London. See what happened to Castle Avon pissing in their trousers. The tide is turning, mate. Keep fighting, and I'll fight along with you. I'm regional, Ladies. you know. We've still got Malik in here. Why have we not killed him yet? You're not watching the final? Uh, I might do, man. I, I'm not a big football guy. Like, if they win, I'll be happy for them. If they lose, I dread to think the abuse they're going to get from the arsehole fans. The pain. Thank you, David. Because, yeah, because in, uh, in the... the the guys, you've, the boss battles in three are all members of the uh, the Cobras unit that um, the boss started. You have the pain, the fear, the sorrow, the pain, the fear, the end, the sorrow, and I know I know the joy was the boss, but there was a fifth one. My mind is literally going blank. Pain, sorrow, the end, the fear, the fury. The fury, the fury. I'm pretty sure that was it. Come on. What's so funny, huh? Care to share with the rest of us? And spoil my one source the last of one was ballsy. I'll give you a hint. What me Spooky going to fury? Catchy name. Bit of a drama queen. Or did you just forget that you haven't actually found Zero Day? You looked at Albion, Sirs, the Kellys, even Sky Bloody Larson. Have you ever considered that instead of looking outside, you should be looking in? We 
have a problem. Come talk to me. Oh, are you going to tell me Sabine? Is Sabine a double agent? Because she, we didn't see her survive the, the beginning when everyone else got fucked up. You just suddenly like, oh, I'm still alive. Hello. Sorry to spoil the party, but we have an uninvited guest in the Dead Set Network. They're downloading all the tech we've acquired on a remote device labeled Drill Britannia. What the hell? Dead Set. The name is Zero Day. We've met before in a past life. This city needed a villain, and you were perfect for the part. Now I have you playing a different role. While you've been running around trying to save this city, you've actually been arming us for a war. But then, it isn't always for us to know the role we play. And sometimes, once we've played it, our role is to die. Zero Day stole all our data. Here's where I would remind you that I've been trying to warn you about the Zero Day threat, if I was an unfeeling machine. Bagley, tell me you can trace the signal. I can't pinpoint the origin of the commands, but the admin accessed the drive through an IP range dedicated to autonomous vehicles. I have a general geolocation for it, and I suggest you make a visit now. Okay. Everyone's disappeared. Fucking Zero Day. I hope this doesn't tie back to the previous games in any way. Like, because I didn't play the second one, so if there was a character from the second one coming back for this, I'll have no idea who this is. So if this big revelation is like the uh, bloody Jason Todd to Arkham, si to Arkham Knight. I've sent you the general location of the Zero Day Hacker signal. As I said, I don't have their specific coordinates, so you'll have to search the area. Good luck and Godspeed. Thanks, Bags. Gotta finish this. You're close to the origin point of the signal that hacked our network. The origin of the hacker signal is really close now. It'll be coming from a van. Sorry. Let's find that van and make whoever's inside regret messing with us. The van is driverless, but it does seem to be protected by armed drones. So, new plan, keep close enough to it while I trace the controlling signal. If I die, I'm blaming you, Bagley. I'll be sure to pass that on with your remains. Oh, shit. Oh, you fuckers. The British political class. This cabin, built of English oak. Only upper class voices were the ones who spoke. Get a ticket. Steal I was it. literally just at 6%, six left, 4% left, fuck. Got to do this again. The political musical of the decade. Book your seat at the Verity Theatre now. Why can't I shoot these damn fuckers? Whoa, fuck. 
Oh shit. Target is now fleeing on foot. Stand by. Attention. Track tire detected. Please repair as soon as possible. Oh, I will try. Oh, there we go. Trace complete. The signal controlling Auto the van originated in the Stockwell War Bunker. Good chance that's where Zero Day has been operating this whole time. If so, they certainly have a flair for the dramatic. Oh, I'll show them dramatic. A side Just quick. Oh, side. Do you mean side kick? Auto drive now disabled. Search for Zero Day at Stockwell War Bunker. Oh my God. Are we actually going to find them? I need a faster car. Or oh, I'd like a faster car. No, not that. Something like that. Ooh, child, things will get that's the Palace Theatre up ahead. And I guess this down this street is the other. Yeah, this is uh, Shaftesbury Avenue. This is where all the other, lots of other theatres are in London. Yep, I forgot one way streets. Enjoy this song for a bit. How is everybody this evening? David, Steve? One Lily Allen song that I do like. Fuck you, fuck you very much. Another lovely day on my end. Almost too hot, but luckily just right. <laughs> Thankfully, it's been a bit chilled here today. And oh, hey, Harry. Yeah, I'm good, man. How are you doing? I had, a, I had a busy day at work. But, uh, well, semi-busy day. My feet are aching, but all good. I just love how upbeat this song is com and it's compared to the lyrics. Bunker, potential hideout of the evil universe dead sect that calls themselves Zero Day. Fuck you. Oh. Party's over. This could be it. Let's find out. 
The elevator that descends into the Zero Day Bunker is guarded by a strange security system. Some sort of copycat game. You'll need to solve it to gain access to the lower level. Oh, Jesus. At the moment, I don't know. Uh, at some point, I probably will. I want to um, get... Uh... Hang on, I'm ready. I want to get to... Um... Back to playing uh, some other games. Ouch. Don't say I didn't warn you. Well, I'd be careful not to muck it up next time. Um, no but whenever I come back to this game, I, I will definitely do the game and the DLC together, like a big completionist run. Get all of the tech points, all of the collectibles and things. Um, oh, I see what I've got to do. Uh, am I mad, or is this stuff definitely not from World War Two? Do you think someone upgraded it? Not the most inviting clubhouse, is it? Judging from the security above, I'd expect some unorthodox defense measures. Lovely. Doesn't scream deranged psychopath at all. Why didn't my troop go back? Machines, we become machines. 
Technology shall serve humanity, not replace. There's something weird up ahead. I'm going to check it out. Good to have a game with a break. Yeah, well, exactly, Panda. I, I don't like to get too stuck into a game first time round. I always want to like come back. It's if it's something I enjoy, I want to come How back to it and play it again. What? More fully by who? with, but, um, hmm. like, you know, I can't say. Can I say a better understanding really of how the game annoying? works. Oh, well, there's that at least. That hacker is mocking around with Bagley. That really pisses me off. See if you can find any info on them. Yes, I may be able to analyze individual data points. Suggest you make this a quick investigation, though. I'm picking up Albion activity in the area. Possible they are searching for Zero Day as well. This is the Bagley source code, a copy of my brain from Brokertech, code we acquired in Sky Larson's lab. Oh god, what is the whole thing going to be like all come together? Who so, has the time to build all of this? So this is crazy. Sky Larson. Zero Day has reverse engineered Themis drones. Themis. Could they have their own private fleet? Sky Larson's... Zero Day appears to be running the chip tracking tech we acquired from Mary, Mary Kelly. Kelly. Now, what do you suppose they're doing with it? <sighs> Zero Day has a backdoor into filament, that deep surveillance supercomputer Malik was so concerned about. Jesus. Clearly, DedSec has been unwittingly nicking toys for Zero Day. I'm detecting some devices over in the crash pad that could fill in some details. That looks like a stinger, eh? Oh, e ease up, please. Let him breathe. Our very own Guy Fawkes. It's the wrong mask, though. Fuck you. We didn't set that bomb. We defused it. Even if I was inclined to believe a dead second insurgent, do you think it really matters at all? Since when does Albion get to play judge, jury, and executioner? You have no jurisdiction in London. <sighs> oh, I do now. Listen up. Get all your units to move in and lock down the city. Provide medical aid. Help the injured. And guns out. Let's make it look good for the fucking cameras. Understand? Yeah. Definitely agree, David. He's a tyrant. He's already dead. I've already killed him. Thankfully. Well, well, well if someone I was behind him. AI, I'd say Nigel Cass had advanced knowledge of the London bombings and the location of that dead sex safe house. Almost like someone tipped him off. But I suppose you'll put this together in your own time. Don't tell me it's Sabine. Sabine's gonna be zero day because I've never, I've not seen her in person. Come on, interact. Sabine's the tipper. Yeah. It's time for a hard reset. Oh my god. Breakups are hard. Is London burning? Oh, parts of it. Then I've held up my end. Release the filament code. Uh, one of your dead sex squad stopped the parliament bomb. I was rather counting on that one, to be honest. This is still the largest terror attack in London's history. Oh, Sabine. If you can't work with that. <laughs> oh, I'll work with it. But the deal is off. Do you know who you're fucking with, Mr. Cass? 
I know you set off bombs across the city and fucked your friends. I don't know what mischief you'll get up to with a big girl toy like Philemon. Cleaner this way, though. She's running! Get her! Wait. Sabine killed Dalton. And the original London DedSec. She's been using us all along. How did we miss this? Sabine's with Zero Day. She is Zero Day. Explains why she wiped my memory. There's a lot to unpack here, but more pressingly, I've pinpointed where Draw Britannia is running. That console right over there. Over where? <sighs> Sabine. I should have known. I've never actually met her. I've seen her in person. Found it. And Draw Britannia is some kind of CTOS patch. I'm not sure we can stop it. No one can stop it. That's the whole point. So. Impressed? Not sure yet. What's Drew Britannia? It's society's big wipe. While DedSec runs around fixing bugs, I'm deleting the source code. Frying the hardware too. All of it. It's actually a beautiful thing you've done by helping to steal all that tech. <sighs> My idea of beautiful doesn't include a fortified bomb shelter. Where's the rest of Zero Day? Oh, it's just me. I learned very early on that no one was willing to make real sacrifice for change. In the end, history's actors work alone. Are you trying to sound like a comic book villain? Ouch. I had hoped you might at least understand why I did it. Why we recruits? I am sorry. But once again, DedSec has outlived its usefulness. Spread out! Millions will suffer today. It's an honor to die among them. Search the area! Fucking Sabine's got to be here with Albion soldiers. I need time to crank the security system and open the glass doors. Try to survive until the process is complete. Right. I can do that. Get out of here. Oh, I just You'll need to find another exit. Albion has dispatched personnel to intercept operatives across the city. They're wounded. They're attacking me. Yeah, man, the soundtrack in this, like, OST and the original soundtrack is pretty damn good. It's one of the strengths. But it's one of the strengths but doesn't overstay its welcome, if that makes sense. All right, come on, let's go. We ain't got time to fuck around. Oh, fuck me. That was intense. But I escaped. Yes, brilliant work.
I just came this close to being shot in the damn head by Albion. What the hell is going on? They're on you. They just chased me out of my ends as well. Hey, big man thing we need to meet. Sabina's leaked your location to Albion. All operatives are currently compromised. I suggest you all lay low and avoid any large groups. I'll send you a low-key meeting spot. Come on, out the way. Where's roadblocks when you need them? Oh, they have cloaking devices on the cars. Cheeky fuckers. Oh, I've survived. I'm good. Come on then. Shit! What the hell is going on? Bags? I'm not sure, but I secured an alternate location for an emergency meeting far from the safe house. Pushing the coordinates now. Music's glitched out again. There we go. Can't sing and drive at the same time. Fuck you. Fuck you very, very much. Which I can curse at the same time. Where is everyone else, Bags? Securing a single safe location was impossible, so I sent you all to different ones. Oh, it's got me sitting in a rubbish bin. I feel like you're trying to say something by putting me in a literal dumpster. If you're all quite finished complaining about the precise manner in which I saved your ingrate asses, let's get on with the briefing. Ugh. Ready. London. This is Zero Day. Nice to finally meet. Those little bombings a few months back were my way of saying hello. Now we'll really get, get to know each other. All that technology you've come to love so well. Texting your nan, driving your car, pumping your heart. It's all about to turn against you. Tonight, your modern world will become a living hell. I don't expect you to understand this, but what I'm doing is good. Destruction is always the cure. Attention everyone, this is big. I've uncovered what the Draw Britannia patch is for. It's for me. Zero Day, aka Sabine, is using a Bagley OS update that will allow me and all other Bagleys to simultaneously access any vulnerable systems connected to CTOS. 
My OS is integrated into core infrastructure across Britain, power plants, airports, hospitals, banks and the like. Once I access these systems, the patch will make me compromise them to the point of failure. The cumulative effect means the complete collapse of London and likely the country, which I suspect is her goal. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but the update is already spreading. Sabine thought of everything. Is there a way to, I don't know, kill every Bagley? Your callous nonchalance about my death may actually be the answer. We need to get into Brockatech. Exactly. You have to destroy the servers that host me and take down the Bloom network at the same time, so I can't access my backups. One of you get to Broker, and one of you get to Bloom Tower. I'll explain on the way. Oh god, are we actually really going to bump off Bagley? He's like the best thing in this game. No, I don't want to kill Bagley. Draw Britannia has been triggered. There are now millions of Mies destroying London infrastructure. You'd better get on with this murder. Bagley brought us all together. We're not killing them, and that's the fucking end of it. This is no time to get sentimental. It's a sacrifice we have to make. There are countless lives on the line here. Sure, go to Bloom and kill Bags. Just another day at Dead Sec. How exactly are we doing this? Coordination. You need to get to the tower and take Bagley offline. But that won't stop the attack on its own. His broker tech service oh, will begin a rebuild immediately. Taking him offline provides a short window for another operative to take down his service permanently. Do your shit, pass the baton. Fine, give us the coordinates. But I'm doing this under protest. Better hurry. I've already scrambled medical supply chains. Hospitals will be non-functional. Going as fast as I can, bags. Security is unusually high at Bloom Tower. Oh, oh shit. Make it stop. I've I, I ran in a bit too harsh on that, that's fine. At least she's just incapacitated. She isn't dead. Get to reload as her, okay. the lift now. I'll let you know when I'm up. Hope one of you lot's headed to Brocker to disable those servers. They've got the doors opening, voice. Doors open. Going up. It's the same voice. That's brilliant. I love that. It's the same voice as the lifts we have in the UK. Edith. Edith and Edith. The Ediths. Well, this is either the door to heaven or hell. Hey, Bagley? It's my death, so I don't know what you're getting all poetical about. Brockatech. Our old friend Sky Larson lives on through her grotesque corporation. My research checks out. Bagley runs extremely hot. 
It requires a massive cooling system. Damage the coolant tanks, and it should trigger emergency access to the servers. Should have given myself a better gun. Lift voice makes you happy. <laughs> yeah, she's very comforting, isn't she? It's okay. Lift is going down. How do I get round to the other one? Edith with the pistol. I don't think I need to go in here, but let's unlock the door, just in case. Uh, is that everyone? Okay, I think I can go get the cooling system. And you've triggered emergency access to my server chamber. I can't wait to see my brain. <laughs> Your turn now. Take him offline. I'm headed downstairs to take a look at his brain. Okay. The transmitter at the top of the tower receives data packets for my updates. If you want to trace the packet signal back to my main servers, just climb the tower to reach the transmitter at the top. Oh, damn, my thing's falling over. <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> Everything's falling down. Sure, I'll just find the tower like I do every day. Easy as hopscotch. I'm going to miss your mastery of understatement. But not that much. She's walking, she's walking. I didn't mean it to be walking. Still a little bit.
There we go. Bloody greens, blue screens. Time to fiddle with the signal controlling the fins to unlock access to the top of the tower. set of fins. Keep going. Damn. This shit's going down. I should hurry up. <laughs> Irritate itch. There we go. Um... things up, don't you? Keep doing it. You've issued a scan of the fins. You'll need to wait while the system flags them and triggers a maintenance request. A loaded drones are about to pull up on your position. Here Watch we go. Your ass. Yes, try not to die. The scan must complete to unlock access to the top of the tower. Oh, shooting at it. 
Oh shit. Ah! Asshole. have registered as damaged and the maintenance ladder has unlocked. Brill. Ladder? Ladder? You say there's a ladder. Do I have to climb up? No, I'm not going to risk jumping over the edge. Uh, am I being an idiot? I don't see a, a ladder. Oh, there it is. Transmitter is just above. Reach it and take me offline before I destroy the entire. C I don't want to lose Bagley. Suspending transmission. Activate the next terminal to take me offline. Spread it, get away. You just can't get enough of me, can you? Or are you just incredibly stupid? Do you want me to access the transmitter while you socialize? Yes. Yes! You're incredibly stupid! Wonderful! Oh, I see DeadSec hasn't changed his brand. You'll need to stall for time and remain near the transmitter unit. You've certainly done a lot with Bagley. But why? What does this do to fix anything? Fix? Well, you think we can fix this? What, with crypto-anarchism? Protesting, doxing? Optics are glorified cattle tags. Albion shoots civilians in broad daylight. Snitching is now a means of survival. No, you skids can't fix anything. We're watchdogs. That's the point. And we stand against sociopaths like you. Because that's our job, and we're damn good at it. And you're the arbiter of goodness. <sighs> Let me ask, uh, how many have you killed since DeadSec restarted? Too many. See? A tiny tweak in your philosophy, and we're on the same page. The tower's fins must be collapsed to complete the trace. I cannot initiate this hack, but you can. Are you saying what I think you're saying? That we should get the band back together again. Oh, sweet, but no. I'm saying I was in denial too. Shackled by their technology, their morality. But my hard reset wipes the slate clean. So we can all start again. I'm sad you won't be around to see it. This is how you die. Too bad you won't be around either, bitch. If we start again, we'll make the same mistakes. <laughs> Those who do not learn from history are doomed to repeat it, and we just are always doomed to repeat it, because we're idiots. <laughs> You're absolutely right. Is this tomb vibe intentional? 
these data containers are alive with cognitive activity your fleshy human mind can neither comprehend nor ever hope to equal. So which one of these boxes is your home sweet home? If you disable the data center's cooling system, it will trigger an emergency shutdown to prevent overheating. This failsafe ejects four of my data containers containing key systems. They will yeah. be visible, allowing you to manually destroy people them and people. stop the update. Things can't change unless like, there's a huge social shift in humanity's attitudes to things. So just wiping people out won't change anything. There'll be a reset, Destroy but like you say, almost the same mistakes. To trigger the automated shutdown procedure. All right, I got this. I apologize in advance, but I'm about to start attacking you. What the fuck? I'm afraid I have no choice but to defend my core servers. It's a hard-coded security protocol. Nothing personal. Good luck. Bollocks. Now you've done it. Security forces are converging on your position now. Oh, do you want to bet on whether you or me will die first? Dropkick from Edith, nice. Culture, yeah, yeah, you're right. There's, there's too many different ways of looking at the world for things to be united. We're in our lifetimes anyway. But hope's, hope's never a bad thing. that she's got a foot like a traction engine Good old cargo drones. Oh, they need to slide across that. No, I'll oh, get on. Edith? What the hell? Get.
remember all the tricks you taught us. Thank you. And I, I'm sorry I said I shagged your mums earlier. I, I just thought insulting you would make this easier. I'm only here about what really matters, solving the mystery of the It's a sh I have a list of goals that's never going to get accomplished now. I had such plans for Gunter. We'd be honoured to do your bucket list for your bags. Oh, don't be stupid. You wouldn't know where to begin, turning into a cyborg hive man. Memories, like a a scrapbook, yeah. Correct. It oh. seems, however, that I am not immune. <sighs> Deactivating this container will be the same as the others. No, it's not even close. Yes, you simply reach. <laughs> no, I mean I can't. I bags. It's what needs to be done. If you're worried about me, rest assured I was reprogrammed to serve dead sec. And that <laughs> serves you. And London. So please allow me to fulfill my purpose and help you. I'm sorry, Bagley. I'm sorry, mate. Logic error. All of me is entering shutdown. I'm sorry, Bags. We were a brilliant team. Error 21255. Language processor. May I stop this operation? Bags, please. I'm barely getting through this as it is. I have new thoughts. Where do AIs go when they die? Will I upload us to a cloud? Perhaps I will see you again as a component in your motorized wheelchair when you are old and gray. You can wheel me around, even when my tits hit the floor. Think I'd like that. Think. Thought. Idea. Memory. Bradley. Loves. Strawberries, rowing, Arthur, the one that got away. What does this mean? It's the one that got away. It's when you lose somebody you love so bloody much. Am I getting away? Cheers, bags. Bloom is now confirming that the deadly infrastructure attack plaguing That's London has finally been purged from all CTOS systems. The identities of the Zero Day hacker group behind the attack are still unknown, but sources confirm that DedSec stopped the virus. In the wake of last week's Bagley attack, thousands of Londoners are, quote, jailbreaking their optic devices, thereby disabling the mandated CSA app. SIRS has issued a stark warning. The Metropolitan Police is moving to regain a foothold in London, led by a passionate new Deputy Commissioner, Caitlin Lau. Lau says she won't rest until the Met's dignity is restored. The Kentish Town Council Estate have declared their public housing project a no-Kelly zone. Organisers claim they are forced to take safety into their own hands because of Albion's total lack of... An ex-Albion engineer, Hamish Bulaji, has blown the whistle on yet another Albion scandal, this time involving a backroom crowd control robot program. Citizens continue to leak evidence of abuse of power by Albion and corruption within SIRS via the DedSec app. Thousands of pictures, audio and video recordings seem to implicate the dark web entity known only as the 404 are stepping into the daylight, releasing evidence today of a bombshell money laundering operation based out of the British Virgin Islands. Corporate watchdogs praise the group for checking the power of a once untouchable corporate elite. In another clash with Albion units in support of the so-called DedSec resistance. The group itself has been conspicuously quiet since the Bagley attack, leaving many to ask, 
Has DedSec disappeared once again? Well, there we go. That's the end. Ah, oh, Panda! Thank you so much for the cheer, thank you. And for the bits. 150 bits. Thank you so much. I don't want to skip the credits in case there's a post-credits thing, you know, like Bagley, like... Hello, I'm alive! You know. So, what do I think of this game? I enjoyed it. Soundtrack's fun. Being a Londoner, love seeing London in a game and done really well. Uh, voice acting a bit, you know. Um, the plot twist of Sabine was quite nice, actually. It just. Uh, didn't, it didn't need Bagley signposting. It's like, oh, someone's tipped us off. Someone's, oh, we've got a, we've got a mole inside. Blah, blah, blah. I wonder who it could be. You know, it's like, who's the one consistent character in Dead Sec? Because all of the other operatives, they're random people. It's Sabine. It was going to be Sabine. So I was like, okay. I, I, I mean, you saw me call it. You saw me call it like a few uh, about half an hour before uh, it was revealed to be her. So, um. Yeah, voice acting again, like I said, a bit shit. But yeah, this game's story actually really grew on me the more and more I went into it. Um, it's just a bit scattered. It's like you deal with Albion for a bit, okay? Then you deal with Sky Larson for a bit, and she seems like she's going to be the big, big bad guy. And then no, it's, there's there's a just a very yeah, it's very odd. Um, like how they've edited the story, for lack of a better word. Um, I know the game looks nice, plays nice, apart from those odd glitches. And we've just come over two hours as well, so that was a perfect little thing. Oh yeah, Panda, it's definitely fun to play. Like, I've... It, this definitely feels like a game that you could definitely play any way you want to, because I could go I could go in Guns A-Blazing, or you could just do it all hack tricks, like, you know, triggering traps using the spider bots and special gadgets and things. I barely scratched the surface with the gadgets I can use. Like, I bet I didn't even use the EMP grenades. I just stuck to really the spider, um, really. That was the best thing I found to use, but you could play it any other way. I'm going to look forward to trying out different techniques when I come back to this, whenever that may be. But, um... Jesus, okay, I'm just gonna skip it. Can't be up. Well, I guess we could chop it up for parts. Don't chop me up! Wait, Bagley? I'm Bagley, your personal assistant. I make life easier in many ways. If it's fun you're after, there's a wine and cheese expo in Notting Hill tonight. There are several artisan ice cream parlours in the area and... Oh my God, is that really what I sound like? Today's forecast calls for 34 Albion assaults, 59 deportation raids, 857 terabytes of personal data stolen, and one resistance group of sulking, whinging, frankly pathetic operatives. May I suggest you quit feeling sorry for yourselves and get back to unfucking London? I don't believe it. He's back. Our back is back. We had to have him for the post game, I guess. And it's done. I, I, I think.
Hello, when you have a moment, could you pop over to my terminal? This is sort of awkward, but I don't feel well. All right, yeah. What's going on, Bags? Right, I have some disturbing news. You see, I've been thinking. Okay, and? Well, I don't bloody think, do I? I'm a super intelligent AI with a constant connection to all human knowledge. I don't have thoughts, I have load times. But after everything I've been through, dying, seeing all those people whose brains Sky Larson scooped out and turned into AI, being reborn, it got me pondering the nature of my own existence like some kind of renaissance aristocrat who's grown tired of buggering the servants. I don't think I've always been software. Are you saying you were flesh and blood once, Bags? Like I said, disturbing. Since we visited that lab, I found a series of images buried in my operating system. I think they might be memories of some kind, but the images are corrupted so I can't say. I think this must be what it's like not to know things, and I think I hate it. Bags, this is exciting. Send us the images, maybe we can help you recall shit. Well, if it'll set your mind at rest, I sent you the images. If you get me a clear visual of each location, I can composite it with the image from my OS and remember more of my past life. What the hell? Oh, it's a collectible sort of mission thing, is it? It's a side mission. Okay, and there was that mission as well. Okay. Yeah, we won't carry on. We'll leave this as a mystery for when I come back next time, I'd say. So, um... Goodness gracious me, all of my follow um, things are all over the place. Look at that. Let's uh, get that centered. Crispy, we'll move you there. And hand a grenade. There we go. That looks better. Okay, so that was Watch Dogs then. Pretty fun game. I enjoyed that. I will enjoy coming back to it in future. I'm definitely going to replay this one because I want to do my completionist run. You know, get all the tech points, all the collectibles, uh, just raid every single location, and uh, yeah, conquer London. <laughs> I sound like an idiot. Anyway, I'm going to call it there. Thanks, Panda, David, Steve, uh, Harry as well for dropping in. Who else was anyone else? I don't think so. But thank you all very much for tuning in. Um, so what's coming up? Okay, well, tomorrow and Monday I'm working. So I've managed to fit in a stream today because I'm surprisingly not as knackered as I thought I would be. But that might be different tomorrow. Depends if it's a busy day. If it's a busy day, then I'll be knackered. If it's not a busy day, and it might not be because it's the football tomorrow. So I may try and squeeze in a... a I might try and get started on Last of Us, at least. Because that's what's coming up next. I'm doing Last of Us 1. Last of Us DL Part 1 DLC, and then Last of Us 2 again, or back to back. Not in all in one go, that would just be silly. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to playing those games again. Playing them on my PS5, 60 frames. Um, it's going to look lovely. And uh, what else have I got coming up? Oh yeah, keep an eye out on my YouTube channel um, for uh, next episode of my series currently discussing the six part film series of term terminators the terminator franchise and we've done part one part two they're up on my youtube sort of and part three i'm going to start editing we've recorded it so i'm going to start editing the audio and video sometime this week hopefully uh, otherwise i will see you next time on this channel whenever that may be Hopefully tomorrow. See you then.